Okay, I'm going to launch my photon on a standard black powder D12-5. I've been launching D16s and they've been uh, failing at a two failed out of six, which is not good. So I'm going back to the uh, good old SD's black powder engine and let's put this one up and hopefully have a successful flight. Nice flight. So now it's a parachute, so it's going to drift a bit. Oh, you got a parachute. <laughs> Everybody's surprised to see a parachute out of me. But they, uh, the, the parachute was a very nice chute, so I just kept it on the design. I added a swivel to this because the bodies tend to spin uh, with tangles, but now you can see the body's spinning, but it's being absorbed by the swivel, so it's not going to tangle. So very nice flight. Uh, parachute's drifting down. Just a little bit over the rise over there. There it is, over there, okay, a little bit of a walk. Good flight. Hey, here we go, again, this is a lock precision rocket. These are very, very tough rockets. They come with a very nice parachute, and it actually comes with a Nomex um, uh, blanket for your par for your parachute. What I like doing those, I like to add this swivel right here. You can see that, there's a swivel here. The idea is that on the way down, Rocket body will tend to spin. And I'm not really sure why they do that. If you're hanging from a parachute, the body spins. But anyways, this swivel here uh, takes the uh, tangling away. So you get a very nice descent and uh, you don't have any tangling. Again, very nice recovery. I don't get a chance to fly this very often, but uh, it, it does fly very, very nice on the B-12, which I just launched on. Very nice rocket from Lock Precision.